Hey Simleys, it's Delicacy here with part three, season two of Let's Play The Sims 4 Barbie. Uh, Amethyst is a, uh, ooh, oh my gosh. What, 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 what? Oh my gosh! <gasps> what was that? Huh? There was an alien. What? What just happened? Was it just an alien ship and nothing happened? Like, I don't understand. I'm so confused right now, but that was really cool. Uh, let's just take care of the baby right now. I don't understand. Is everyone okay? He's asleep. Amethyst is happy. Uh, let's just maybe replace that. We'll get her to... I just get her to go to sleep. Is Gem okay? Gem's asleep. I'm so confused. Space action. Yeah, you did. Uh, yeah, in the last part, I just want to check that everyone's okay. Hmm. I think they just came to chill for a bit. Hot and happy from stone massage. That's nice. Doing push-ups after keeping out. Okay. I don't know, guys. I'm sorry about that uh, little... <laughs> little uh, detour on the LP just then but anyways that was fun that was fun so in the last part Jem kissed honey and uh, then they had a little fool around in the spaceship which was pretty crazy and uh, Diamond had her first day at work and yeah it went relatively well I think uh, she has work in seven hours her performance is doing okay except she was late for work so that was my bad sorry about that uh, okay, so, Barbie, 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 where are you? Oh my god, Barbie's abducted! I can't believe I didn't realize! Oh, what? Barbie got abducted. How could I not realize that? I just went through them, I'm like, oh, I'm good. Oh my gosh, Derpy Deli. Um, does this mean, what happens when they get abducted? I don't actually even know. I don't know off the top of my head. Do they just come back with a... Do they come back with an alien? Or do they come back with... Like a pet alien or something? I don't even know. Oh my gosh, Ken, your wifey's up in space and you don't even care, you're asleep. Oh my goodness. Um, oh, where is she? Where is she? Days zapped and jolted from being abducted. Whatever those aliens did really messes with the head. What? So she's just dazed. Oh my gosh. You know what? I think in this part it's time to age up little Ruby because I cannot stand this crying baby anymore. So that's what we're going to do in this part. So actually, nothing happened to her. Tinistic, fertile business savvy, shrewd. Anything in your inventory? Oh, I was really hoping for something else to happen. Hmm. I guess not. I mean, in the, in the comments down below, do let me know if I missed anything, but I didn't... I don't see anything. I don't know what happened. Oh, well. Uh, alrighty, so... Oh my gosh, she's still in her space outfit. Uh, honey, you might have overstayed your stages quietly. Uh, okay, so we're going to think about a birthday for, for Ruby. So I think we should make everything red. And what we'll do is we'll have the birthday probably after the kids finish school. I think that would be quite nice. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think that would be cute. Cute, cute, cute. All right, so it's 5 a.m. Diamond's energy is looking pretty good. So we might get her up early for her work. Uh... She's looking all good, all good. Might get her to have some breakfast. Aha! Oh, Ken, Kenny boy, you are learning to cook, son. Good to see you. Oh, and a lot of you guys didn't like his hair, actually. Uh, let's have breakfast, scrambled eggs. I think she'd just make them for herself, Diamond. She's a little bit like that. Uh, oh, and we forgot to get Barbie to have her meds. So... My bad. She's better now. Let's just 
take medicine. She's had like quite a difficult time. Like she was already sick and then the aliens took her. Maybe the aliens fixed her. And she was dazed, but okay, now she's fine again. Over medicated. This is Barbie. This is Barbie on prescription drugs. Any questions? <laughs> what? Oh, uh, well, she seems to be not dazed anymore, so that's always a good thing. It's always very good. Let's just have a little bounce with Ruby before she ages up. Wouldn't it be awesome if she ended up with red hair? We should dye her red when she's older for shizzle my nizzle. Alright, so she's gonna eat something. Kenny is starving Marvin. So we'll get him to use the toilet. We might just get him... Oh, let's open this up and see what we have. We have nothing? Oh my gosh. Well, he got something out. What? I, I, okay, okay. Uh, maybe we'll, well, we may as well get Ken. What was he cooking before? Let's make a gourmet meal. Let's make some <gasps> macaroons. Yum. That's not really breakfast though. I mean, that doesn't look too exciting, but we'll do it anyways. All right, diamond, are you going to eat that up or are you going to, yep. Yeah. And it would be good if she could have some fun, but she really has work, like. Oh no, she might have time to have some fun. Let's. Oh, there's the salad he made. Well, we may as well get him to make another one. And I love that Amethyst is. Oh, well, I thought she was sleeping in, but not really. It's only six thirty. Uh, oh, her performance has dropped quite significantly. Uh, I reckon we get her up. Get her to have some breakfast. Just have breakfast, maybe some oatmeal for you. And then Topaz. Uh, Lenny actually said in the comments down below that uh, he wanted to see more of Topaz. And he kind of imagined Topaz to be, or she kind of imagined, I don't know if it's a he or she, but just imagined <laughs> Topaz would be more of a class clown, whereas someone else thought he'd be like a nerdy science kid. Uh, but he's a social butterfly, so I feel like he could be really funny. Because he's already a goofball, so, so he is a bit of a class clown clown oh and that's right uh olivia said can you please change diamond's skin because she's worried that diamond will later on have a kid that's orange <laughs> funny funny yeah let's get rid of her fake i kind of like her having Rebaza. fake tan though i like her character in fake tan i think it's so realistic like she would she would do that didn't mean to uh, do that little screenshot then. Sneaky one. Um, okay. Let's put that over there. We're basically the Barbie family's made. We always clean up all of their stuff. Like, we should really get better at that. Okay. Are you going to eat chips? No. Eat something... Eat something proper. Have some cereal. Cereal's so good. I could grow cereal. Oh, isn't this sweet, you guys? All right, let's let's have funs up. Let's change. Her. How well are we looking after their needs today? For once, cleaning up. You guys, I'm on a roll today. On a roll. <sighs> I'm actually in a really good mood today. I'm a bit tired, but I read lots of your comments and it made me feel really good. So thank you guys. Alright, so, oh, she's pretty. It is, it is a good tan she's got going on. Uh, I think she was around... So we want her to be quite pale. What's more Barbie like? Barbie's always been like quite pale, hasn't she? Mm. Yeah, okay. I might have gone a little bit overboard on the tan. I'll I'll admit that. I'll take that. <laughs> I don't mind that though. Cause that's quite like that's not orange. Mm. Oh, it's so hard to choose. 
Now we'll go with her kind of Barbie, original Barbie coloring. So we'll go with this, I think. Um, and that'll be fine. Also, my chair just squeaked. I did not do a pop off if some of you guys thought that's what it was. I don't, I don't know if you guys can hear it, but Deligracy never does pop offs, okay? <laughs> never. We'll just leave it at that because TMI right now and this is just getting awkward. So I'm just going to shut up. Uh, alrighty, back to comments. Uh, thank you, Danny J096, for saying you're loving the new thumbnails and that they're very pretty. I really appreciate that. Appreciate that comment because I actually put a bit of effort into them. I was like, I really want like something fresh, something new, something colorful and happy. Uh, oh, Amethyst was like, oh, I don't know what to wear today. I like her hippie outfit. It's cool. Oh, who's crying? She's sad because she's over medicated. Friend has passed. What friend passed? Like Margie ages ago? I don't understand. Well, Barbie, we need to start setting up for this party. And we're going to have to have it at home, I think, because it's a baby. So I can't really go anywhere. Otherwise, I would have actually quite enjoyed going to a different venue. So let's have a think. Let's have a think. For a baby to child party. I mean, it should be a kid's theme. Could have a garden gnome party with red chairs. Yes! We are so doing that. Let's do it. I love it. A garden gnome party. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. All right, let's, let's go for it. So we're gonna make everything red. Fabulous and red. I kind of am thinking we might leave the umbrella white because we still want it to be very like classy Barbie. Oh no, 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 no. We, we'll go all, we'll go the whole, the whole hog, uh, which means we'll need these to be red, these to be red, and can we make this red? Not really. Uh. Mm. Do we want to recolor some of the rose bushes? <laughs> Quite funny. Uh, all right, so uh, I feel a bit awkward that there's like a, um, a a graveyard right here. So let's let's put let's put this on for starters. BB dot move objects on. Excellent. Pop that back here. I don't know. Maybe we'll just block this off for a while because they're kind of crying all the time and. I'm just not really loving all the crying. It's just just not into it. Uh, we'll pop those there. Just maybe extend this garden area so there's a lot more room for the party to happen over here. And yeah, it should be pretty fabulous. As always, all of Barbie's events are fabulous, of course. At the dream house. Okay. So if we're having a garden gnome party, I mean, I know it's a little bit creepy, but I feel like Barbie just goes over the top a lot. And hey, it's kind of cute too. And we've got the flamingos to let everyone into the party here. I might just move these for now because we don't really want all the exercise gear in the way. So we'll just kind of pop them to the side. Put the music on in this area and then we'll get, we'll get some more surfaces. We'll get a... Uh, Ooh, let's go with ruby red sequins. Yes, 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 yes. I'm so feeling this. Uh, <laughs> I'm so feeling this. How's the sass? Okay, put a couple of tables around. Um, a ruby red party for ruby, for ruby. Gosh, ruby's going to be one interesting character, I think. I don't know, I feel like maybe she's the feisty one because she's got, I don't know, red is such a powerful color. I don't know what you guys think, but maybe we'll go like this. Is this a little bit cute? It's a bit weird, but I kind of like it. All right, and then we probably should move the bar down that end. So I think we'll move this part of the bar temporarily. We should have situated. Oh, you guys are gonna, some of you guys will not like me moving that away from its uh, current location where 
the grass has been painted perfectly around it, so I won't do that to you guys. Just move these out of the way and we can move them back afterwards. Mm, we can move these ever so slightly. There we go, they're still in the middle, no one freak out. And then do we want the bar to be black? Ah, the white's pretty classy. All right, we need more garden gnomes. Decorations. Oh, what did I do? I spun it with a K, duh. That's embarrassing. Wouldn't that be awkward if you did that in front of thousands of people on YouTube? <laughs> oh my gosh. That is really embarrassing. Uh, I have actually taken... What? I don't know. I have taken a spell check off my phone because I used to be a good speller and I don't know because I'm just not... That's not a gnome. That is... Is that a gnome? Yeah, that's a gnome. It just didn't have its red hat, so I got really confused. Oh, new gnome. Yeah. It's so cute. Uh, so yeah, I took spell check off my phone, so now I have to check words. And that's why I've been having a lot of spelling errors on Twitter. Oh, this is so cute. A garden gnome party. I'm so having a garden gnome party one day. Put a nice red pot in the corner. Do you reckon that's enough gnomes for now? Oh, this one's pretty cool. Oh, a little bit over at the top, isn't it? Okay, so we've got a little bit of music. Maybe the music should be over here so there's more room for the dancing side. And we'll need an extra table for the cake. Maybe we can pop the cake just over there. And I think that'll be nice. God, I can't believe I spelt gnome with a okay. That is really embarrassing. Oh, I'll move on, moving on. Okay, so let's do this. I mean, we'll wait till the kids get home, so it's all set up in the morning, but what we will do is get Barbie like happy again. Uh, and we'll get Barbie to cook a cake. I wish we could make a red velvet cake. That would be cool. What if you can with a baking skill, but I don't think, yeah, we're, we're, we're a little bit off the baking skill. <laughs> okay, cook a gourmet meal. We'll have a white and black cake. So fancy. I'm just gonna double check. We can't make any red cakes. Zombie cake. That is Awesome. Yeah, we're making a zombie cake. Green and red go together, right? And Ruby might be the saucy one in the LP, the one that's a little bit, mm, I don't know, a little bit crazy. Likes to stir the pot a little bit, perhaps. Do comment down below what kind of character you think Ruby's going to be. Uh, I do find that very interesting. Oh my gosh, you're late again, are you? Oh no, feel we're not too late. It's fine. Her ideal mood. Oh, we didn't do our daily task. Oh, Barbie, she's an emotional wreck these days. You guys are right. She is having an emotional crisis. Crisis, crises. Gosh, she and Ken are so skilled at cooking these days. I feel like Ken would probably want to cook some biscuits for the party or something too. Because he's so cute like that. We should get everyone to wear red for the party. That would be fun. Yeah, we'll do that. I'm just gonna fast forward a little bit. Uh, oh, <laughs> how cute. Uh, Jem's teacher approaches him in class with an offer. Stay through lunch, do some extra credit assignments and maybe he can bump up his grade. Do the work. He learned that sometimes in life there's credit for just showing up. Oh, good. Good stuff. Let's, get, let's make sure that's um, gotten rid of that. Let's clean these up. 
put that in the fridge. Gosh, it's a mad messy house, this one, but we're getting better at it, you guys, and I'm proud of us. Yeah, let's pop that in there. Pop that in there. Okay. All right, I think we need to put them in red outfits. So, change appearance. Okay. And uh, we'll put them in party, party wear, I think. Party wear, maybe we'll make a party wear too. What a choose All righty. Alrighty, so I think I've picked their outfits. So this is Diamond's makeup. We're going with the bold red lip sequins uh, dress. And then we've got Gem just in the plain red suit. Uh, Barbie's got her hair down in this lovely LBR, shall we say? No, no wait, what? Little black dress, L-R-D, L-R-D. There we go, very nice. <laughs> Ken's in the full sparkle -arkles. Um And then Amethyst is just playing it cool in her own little get up with her purple hair. That doesn't really go, but you know, whatever. No makeup as well. And Topaz is looking really, really cute. So that's pretty much their outfits ready. Um, but I reckon, oh, I reckon what we do is I'm going to wait till the next part to do the party because I don't want to rush the party and that way I can also check the comments to see what kind of girl you think Ruby's going to be because we have to pick her first trait and I would like all of your feedback on that because uh, that's going to be very very interesting but I really 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 want her to have red hair that would be like my dream come true but I don't know if that's going to happen. But anyways, guys, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon.